Hey, what's up guys? This is Kimmerman from Kimmerman Gunpla Studio and today I have here a model kit which is uh, not a humanoid mecha model or else I can say it's not a Gundam model kit and this is my third um, model kit that is not a robot and instead this is a uh, this is an aircraft or aircraft fighter from one of the most influential anime that contributes to the production of uh, Gundam, Macross, and Evangelion. And this is uh, created and written by Yoshinobu Nishizaki and uh, it was published or released in 1974. So uh, as uh, I remember it was October 1974 and as of this uh, recording, today is September 11, 2024. It's nearly 50 years since it was released. And this is none other than the space battleship Yamato. And I have here the Bandai Cosmo Zero Alpha, which I bought from Mandarake uh, shop last year, 2023. And now, since I finished all my backlogs, the Gundam uh, model kits and uh, Photobokia Modoroid uh, model kits, I already finished them. Now I'm starting to do the non humanoid mecha model kits, such like the Cosmo Zero Alpha. A uh, brief uh, Info about this anime since this is an old anime 1974. Actually, I watched the uh, reboot, I think that's the reboot uh, last year where the graphics is uh, in par with the um, current anime that we are watching uh, these days. And the story is really nice, it's uh, a quest, it's like a war quest. And they are using the space battleship Yamato. They, they're fighting the space. And uh, as far as I know, uh, this is the era where um, the Japanese created the genre of space battles in the anime. So this is very nice. Uh, they're fighting with the Gamilas because the Gamilas, uh, you know. <laughs> I don't want to spoil the story, but uh, the war uh, started when the Gamilas uh, tried to drop the meteor to the Earth. And of course, the Earth suffers, and now the Earth is retaliating by using their uh, flagship space battleship Yamato. So, too much for that. Just watch the anime and uh, let's uh, focus on the unboxing of this. Cosmo Zero Alpha Space Battleship Yamato from Bandai. Bandai Cosmo Zero Alpha 172 scale. And this is the main fighter that is being launched by the Battleship Yamato. And this is piloted by Suzumu Kodai, the main protagonist. And uh, Suzumu Kodai is. Um, uh, eventually became the captain of the Yamato fleet and uh, I really like that character and uh, unfortunately his brother Mamoru Kodai died while uh, defending the other fleets from being chased by the enemies and uh, uh, this pilot this uh, Cosmo Zero here is the main um, fighter that's being launched and uh, um, battling the small sp spacecrafts or aircrafts from the anime. So I'm not really familiar with the, the terms that they use in this, the aircrafts since I was uh, in tune with the Gundams and uh, the other mecha model kit. So this is my third time building a non-humanoid um, kit. That's why, forgive me for um, not so 
uh, informative in such terms. But in the story, uh, this is the main fighter and its partner is the Cosmo Zero Beta. So let's uh, check the box here. We can see here the um, the main uh, kit along with the other kits here, the Falcos and uh, there the uh, battleship Yamato in the background. Very nice. And then the side of the box, we can see, um, yep, the the nose of the fighter, the exhaust, the cockpit, and uh, the wheels, the landing gear, like that. So this is how it looks uh, without the uh, missiles, but. Since uh, this kit has a gimmick and contains a missile as its weapon, you can attach it and uh, put it on the wings like this. So this will uh, uh, be like this. Okay. And the other side of the box, we can see there the Yamato or uh, the Cosmo Zero on the action base stand and there's a clip there are clips here from the anime and uh, there are the armaments that you can attach to the wings and there there's a pilot figure of uh, Susumu Kodai and as you can see this is uh, still not yet opened I uh, forgot to check this <laughs> since I got too many backlogs so I set aside this uh, kits uh, before but now uh, let's check if the uh, box is complete so there it's still uh, being wrapped with this plastic here from uh, Mandarake you can see here the uh, tag here it says here Mandarake Okay, let's open. So now, let's see what's inside the box. So if we open the box here, yep, we can see the um, multicolored runner which is uh, red clear uh, yellow and uh, black parts here so this is uh, runner A and we got this uh, gray parts here with the uh, water slide decals and uh, I'm very <laughs> fascinated with this logo since it is like the EFSF or the Earth's Federation Space Force in Gundam and the UN Spacey or the United Nations Space Navy from the Macross anime. So, uh, Space Battleship Yamato here has the UNCN or the United Nations Cosmo Navy <laughs> under the United Nations... Uh, Cosmo Force or Cosmic Force. So very nice. <laughs> uh, it has a similarity with the EFSF and uh, the UN Spacey. And then we got here um, my parts with this uh, UNCF Cosmo Navy logo, Yamato. And uh, yeah, this. Uh, um, this crest here is very nice. I really like this. I really, really, really like this uh, crest here, the logo. Then we got here uh, white parts again for the hull. And then another white parts for uh, the missiles. And, uh, yep, missiles again. So we got uh, so ma many missiles here. And finally, we got this um, action base uh, stand for uh, 
biscuit very nice black one and uh, there we got the instruction manual let's check this manual as we can see the uh, uh, Cosmo Zero Space Care Fighter 172 scale and uh, um, beside it is the uh, Cosmo Zero Beta and uh, there's no um, difference with this uh, kit except for the colors um, the Cosmo Beta has a light orange and the Cosmo Alpha has this um, deep orange here with some yellow um, linings on the borders of the ship while the Cosmo Beta has white um, linings there and let's check the parts list here it's not that much so I think I can finish this kit um, maybe one hour or two hours then uh, there we can see the warnings here the safety guidelines in Japanese and uh, there it's uh, black and white print so typical Bandai uh, uh, manual and uh, it's new for me to be honest manini bago ko kasi I got used to uh, building uh, humanoid mecha and this time this is a jet fighter or a, uh, a space fighter or spacecraft something like that so there is the pilot Susumu Kodai we have uh, a colored print out here of uh, the front view and rear view of the uh, macros model kit ah macros um, Cosmo Zero sorry Okay. So there. And at the back we can see the placement of the decals, the placement guidelines for the decals. So as always, let's have a quick runner review before we build the kit. And uh, we got here the only colored part of um, the aircraft which is the yellow red and uh, black here and we got um, clear parts here for the canopy this is uh, runner a and uh, this comprises of uh, the detail linings for the hull and uh, this is the nose for the aircraft and uh, most part of it are white and uh, there we got gray here so we got this gray parts for the cockpit and uh, there for the booster i think and let the landing gears here so this is runner b and uh, we got white parts here for the wings and uh, this runner c and the pilot figure here is uh, a little bit uh, larger than your 1100 scale because uh, this is a 172 scale uh, pilot and uh, there we got the standing figure of uh, Susumu Kodai and uh, there on the cockpit also so this is uh, runner C for runner D we got this uh, another white parts for the hull and for runner E, we got uh, two sets of it for the missiles. And we got the black uh, runner here for the action base stand that is included in the kit. And we got this screws for uh, attaching this on. And we got interesting stickers and uh, water slide decals here. Uh, we got here these. Uh, Crest here for um, the logo of Cosmo Zero and this uh, UNCN insignia, which is uh, or which stand for the United Nations Cosmo Navy, 
and uh, it's up to you if you want to apply the one or the two because this is the alpha and the beta okay. and we got this uh, interesting uh, foil sticker which uh, bear the logos of uh, the UNCF Cosmo Navy uh, Yamato Cosmo Force and uh, the United Nations logo which is very nice I but unfortunately, you, you cannot attach this with the kit because uh, this is for the uh, action base stand here. And uh, there we got this Alpha 1 and uh, the Alpha 2. So, yep, correction. Uh, I said earlier it's the uh, Cosmo Zero Beta, but instead this is the Cosmo Zero Alpha 2. And uh, the kit that we are unboxing is the Cosmo Zero Alpha 1 okay so sorry for that uh, I hope you enjoyed the unbox unboxing of this uh, Cosmo Zero Alpha 1 of the Space Battleship Yamato and uh, I'm happy to pair this with the RX-78 our RX-78 and the Macross VF-1J Valkyrie. So this is Kimmerman from Kimmerman Gumpla Studio saying good night, God bless and take care and happy building. Uh, see you around after I build the kit and let's have a quick review of it after. So, tschüss, auf Wiedersehen, paalam sa inyong lahat, masalamat.